At the Moy Gardens in Kericho, the party that ruled the country from independence to 2002 and whose popularity has arguably dwindled since then, was here to unveil its flag bearer for the March 7th Kericho Senate mini poll. In what appears an indication, the party is keen to use the by-election to send out message to those who may think it has lost the steam to crowd its top brass, who are here to endear itself to the electorate. Lakini ile mlango ambayo tunajua tunaweza kuponyelea kutoka ni county government na devolution. Ambayo mali tunajua itakuja hapa kwetu. Na ndio hiyo tunataka watu ambayo ni shupavu. Sang, who formerly served as Bureti Member of Parliament, called on residents of Kericho to turn up in large numbers to vote for him and a party that he says has over the years embraced development. Bomet Governor Isaac Ruto, who recently launched his Mashinani Development Party of Kenya, used the occasion to throw his weight behind the Kanu candidate, dashing any prospects of his party squaring out with Jubilee Alliance. Fika wakati wa ujaguzi tarehe saba mwezi wa tatu na wasihi ninyi nyote mjitokeza kwa wingi na muniunge mkono niwe mwakilishi wenu katika Senate ya Kenya. The Bomet governor has been embroiled in endless supremacy battles with Deputy President William Ruto in the Vote Rich Rift Valley region. Sang will now battle it out with Jubilee's Aaron Cheriut and Bishop Daniel Tonui of National Vision Party during the by-election that seeks to replace Charles Keter, who has since been appointed Energy Cabinet Secretary.